Hello, friends. Welcome to Kurt Berglund's Baseball World. And today, it's time for the December version of my channel update. Lots of stuff to go through with you in this channel update. Thank you for joining me. I like to tell you about where things are going with all the stuff that I've got going on. Um, and I'll give you a health update later on and uh, kind of give you the two are related, as you might imagine. So um, first, we'll talk about current projects. Um, the vintage APA season that has started and we've gotten through um, uh, of one game for all the teams. Some of it is online, some of it is offline. It features classic APA cards from the 50s and 60s that I have collected. Um, that will be continuing uh, indefinitely. I'm gonna be running that for quite a while. It's probably gonna go through most of 2023 on some basis. Um, that's, I'm going to talk about that more when I get to my uh, health update for you as well. But uh, the good news about the vintage APA season and the reason why it's an important part of what I'm doing, I love the old APA cards, but uh, it also uh, is something that I can do before I completely run out of breath or start coughing. So it's a, it's a good option. Um, and I love, I love that, those APA cards, um, and I'm working on my collection all the time. Um, King of the Hill with Fall Classic Baseball, um, uh, got reintroduced, returned, uh, on Monday night. And I think I'm going to keep it on Monday nights for a while, uh, as a weekly feature, um, the King of the Hill is about, for the, the first place teams are tied with four wins at the current time. It's a fall classic baseball tournament. If you win, you keep playing. And that tournament, um, I would imagine, will be done sometime in spring at the current pace we're going on. Um but a good winning streak can bring it to a quick conclusion as well. So we'll see what happens. Um, the next thing is uh, APA cards. I'm working on APA compatible cards with Chris White. And we have produced uh, two sets to this point. The all-time All-Stars set um, that has 60 cards. 160 cards. It costs $66. It's free from Chris for shipping. If you tell Chris you saw my video, shipping is free. Um, and that is, that's, and you get a PDF uh, that gives you information on the players and you get the envelopes that Chris makes um, with so many of his sets. That set is available for $66 right now. The second set that we worked on with Chris is um, the 2022 Japanese League, the NPB set. That is currently available for $109, if you tell Chris you saw my video, um, $109 shipped. Um, if you tell Chris you saw my videos, 120 if you don't tell him, so it's 11 bucks off. Kurt Berglund brings the discounts. Um, and so that, those two sets are available now. There is a great team set coming. Uh, there is also a World Baseball Classic set coming. There is a 2021 Olympic team set coming. So there's a lot of NPB baseball coming your way in the next weeks and months. And so looking forward to bringing that to you on my channel as well. Uh, with the all-time all-star set, we're three games into a season with them um, and uh, having a lot of fun with that. Already had a no-hitter. We've had slugfests. We're all over the board. It's been a lot of fun. Um, so that's gonna continue. I'm gonna do some 2022 games 
uh, with the NPV set later this month um, that you can expect as well and on into January and February. Uh, so those will be continuing. And I also want to go through and start cycling through some games with uh, that I haven't shown you in a while. And so there'll be some one-offs coming uh, as well uh, for you to take a look at. One of them will be a Pine Tar Baseball game. For the members of my channel, there are a couple of Pine Tar teams that you may be interested in. The members get free PDFs every month with their membership from me, cards that I am creating or have created for different games. And if you are a member as of December 1st or any time into December, um, the two teams this month are Pine Tar teams. Uh, one team is the 2022 Phillies, the National League champion Phillies. Um, this team and the, the Pine Tar teams come to you on sheets of nine on a PDF. So the first team... Uh, you get two teams per month. This month, they happen to be Pine Tar. In other months, they've been APA. They've been Status Pro. I think I've done some other stuff, too. But this month, they're Pine Tar. This is the 2022 Phillies. This is what they look like. Uh, 27 cards. If you are a member, and I'm going to put the link for membership in the description for this video. I'm also going to put Chris White's email in the description for this video, as well as the prices for the sets. Uh, the NPB sets that I was just talking about. The second uh, team that you get with membership this month is the 2020, I'm sorry, the 2001 Seattle Mariners. Uh, this is one that um, folks have been looking for. I redid the colors for the Mariners since I first did this set uh, to try and match the Mariners uniforms of the time. And I think I got closer. Um, anyway, I have no, these. No one's ever seen these before. Uh, this is also a twenty-seven man set for Pine Tar. So the two teams that you get as a thank you for membership this month are the twenty twenty-two Phillies and the two thousand one Mariners. I'm going to be playing a game on my channel between these two teams. Uh, I believe it's next week uh, coming up. Also, on the membership side of my channel, I have a poll going right now of the World Series that I'll be replaying in December, only for members. Um, right now, the 67 World Series is in the lead, but there's five to choose from. If you are a member and you haven't voted, you should do that so that we can get all the votes in. I'll cut off voting uh, in a few days and then get started on that series. Also for members, I'm going to be putting up a poll for the special report on the game on uh, baseball sims that I'll do for December. I'll put up a poll for that and you can vote for that first week of December. That will be up. Um, another uh, thing that will be continuing on my channel will be uh, the here's the pitch previews. Uh, right now, we're in the middle of a replay of the 1974 World Series. I'm going to do some mixing and matching uh, games, some what-if games coming up in December and January with Here's the Pitch. So I'm looking forward to that. Um, and uh, I've always got the latest and greatest ordering flyer for Here's the Pitch. All you have to do is send me an email at berglund.curt at yahoo.com. And I'll send that to you for free and you can get communicate with Dominic about what teams you want. Dominic is always adding to his inventory. And so you can um, communicate with him and get those uh, teams ordered uh, very easily. Uh, next is people ask about the secondary store. And this will tie into my health as well. No secondary store this week. I'm hoping to do a secondary store next week, which will be the first week of December, uh, health permitting. Uh, a lot of different stuff that I have for you in that secondary store. So I'll be looking for that as well. <clears throat> now we may as well talk about my health. 
I appreciate all of the concern that you have shown, emails and well wishes and messages. Uh, they, matter, they matter and they help. Um, my problem has been with a cough that doesn't go away. And I have seen my regular doctor and I've seen um, urgent care and they're telling me there's nothing more they can do for me except send me to their emer emergency room, which naturally is not an option that I would really like to take. I'm seeing a specialist in a couple of weeks. You can hear from my voice that <clears throat> sometimes it comes and sometimes it goes and it's the cough is, is reduced and that's the good news and I'm very grateful for that. Uh, what's not reduced is that I am breathing very strangely. I'm well, like my grandfather <clears throat> had emphysema. I don't have emphysema. I'm not telling you that. But he taught himself a different way to breathe because he couldn't take deep breaths. And that's kind of where I'm at. <clears throat> so if my voice sounds funny on a particular video, that's why. Um, and that's why longer videos with longer games. <clears throat> are a problem. Um, and so I'm doing less long form games. <clears throat> I'm doing games that try and average between 40 and 50 minutes or even less, uh, because my voice can't do it. Um, and that affects my stamina and that affects my ability to set up things like the secondary store. So that's why we're a little bit behind schedule and why my schedule, my video schedule was so funky because sometimes in, in November, my voice would sound okay. I'd blast myself with inhalers and hit the videos. And sometimes that would work. And other times it would sound like right now. And so it's just crazy. Anyway, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be fine. I just have to kind of work through it. But uh, that's where um, more APA heavy videos come in. And... Uh, reducing some of the other videos because they simply take 55 minutes or sometimes more than an hour, uh, for example, to do a status pro game uh, it, and, or a replay game uh, often takes an hour or more. And what happens is I can't talk that long. And so it, it's a problem. So gradually we'll work the other stuff back in as, as I get uh, back to normal health. So that is everything, I think. Check out the description for the video. Um, and I've been on antibiotics. I've been on everything. I'm not contagious or anything. I'm not walking around like I'm contagious, but it's frustrating. It's been a long, long, long journey. I've been, I had um, pneumonia back in May and I had it again, was diagnosed for it again about a month ago. And it's just... Um, and in between, I've had uh, bronchitis, and they suspected allergies and all sorts of stuff. I don't know what's going on, but we'll find out. In the meantime, I appreciate your patience, and I thank you for your well wishes. So next week, be looking, I hope, for a secondary store. If my stamina holds up, we'll be doing that. And um, that'll be our December secondary store. Uh, channel membership uh, this month will feature probably, but the voting's not done yet, but it'll probably feature the 67 World Series. Also, the gifts this month will be the 2001 Mariners and the 2022 Phillies. Um, you, but you got to email me for those. If you are a member of my channel, email me for those, and I'll send those out to you. They are a gift for members only. And, and... The special report voting for members will start next week as well. So that's where we are. Have a wonderful evening. And I appreciate all that you do for my channel. Let's continue our journey. Have a great day. So long, everybody.